this is Leo from Bonjour Schola. And uh, today I'm going to show you a connection and a test of the Bonjour Schola solar uh, freezer, solar ice maker to connect with our MBPT, our Bonjour Schola gel battery, and the Bonjour Schola solar panel. I will show you the whole uh, connection diagram. And uh, because now in some of the area, more and more people, they need the ice maker, especially for the African country. So uh, I will give you a general presentation about the DC, the solar uh, freezer connection diagram. So uh, because uh, we already uh, finished the connection, so we can turn on the freezer. So you can see the light is on. And then in fact, inside is already cold inside. So everything is working now. And uh, you can see inside there are so many different uh, level. We separate different level. If you think uh, this one is two level, in fact, you, you can take uh, one of like this or even two of like this. So the cut, the, the, the the level uh, cover, you can take some of them so that you can have more space here. So this is the uh, weighted power is uh, 180 volt, 24 volt uh, battery system, 24 volt uh, solar freezer. So it's going to be very useful in the uh, area of the lack of uh, electricity. Now I'm going to show you more about the connection. Okay, now we can see more details of the connection. So this is the uh, ice maker, the uh, DC freezer. So here, these two are the gel battery, 12 volt, uh, uh, 200 amp hour. Two pieces in series. That means there are there is the 24 volt system. And uh, this one is the solar panel, of course. So now I am going to show you the connection of the system. So we, this one, the solar panel, more details, very clear. And uh, we can see this one is the uh, positive of the solar panel, positive to the fuse. Because for the safety, uh, system safety, we, uh, connected the uh, fuse. This is the 50 amp fuse uh, for the positive. And then for the protection, if the current from the solar panel is over 50 amps, so that means uh, this fuse will, will, will broken and then will protect the whole system just for, for safety. And then parallel to the, uh, the breaker, the breaker here and the parallel to the surge arrestor. Surge arrestor. Uh, this is positive and positive here. Uh, the bus bus, because of we will have another system, so that's why we make a bus bus here. And then another breaker to the MPPT. This is positive. And uh, that will be the same, the same thing for the uh, negative. Negative here. The breaker, but negative, we no need to uh, use the fuse because uh, if this fuse uh, broke, if this fuse uh, is broken, this the, the the panel there is no current, so we make a one fuse. It's okay, and uh, for the negative, like here, the parallel with the surge arrestor, and uh, you need to make attention is that uh, there's, there's the a uh, cable for the ground connection, the earth cable. Uh, you must do uh, connect the earth cable when you make the system for the solar panel. This is very important when you make the connection of the surge arrestor. Okay, the, the, the same thing, the bus bus to the MPPT. The MPPT, positive, negative, positive, negative. And then for the battery side, you can see here, for the MBVD, the positive, we make a, a, a very good quality uh, breaker, uh, 125 amp to protect the battery and the MBVD. And then the bus bus, 
to connect the gel battery yeah, for the positive, uh, for the positive uh, connection. And then for the negative, you can see also here to the bus bus and the battery. For the loading, there is also there are also positive and negative, low positive and negative, and then you see, you can see there is no air breaker between the MBPD and the uh, the uh, DC uh, freezer. Why we do not make uh, the breaker? Because uh, most of the MBPD, you can control the low on or off from the uh, MBPD side, so. We can control here to turn the loading on or to turn the loading off. So we no need to break that side. But of course, if you want to be more safe, if you want to be more safe, you need to uh, install a uh, DC breaker over there. Okay. So this is uh, for the whole connection. So it will be very clear. Okay, now so we can see more clear, clear the uh, connection uh, from the solar panel, the fuse, the air breaker, the surge arrestor, the earth uh, connection, the ground connection, the positive, negative, and then we can see also here. We can see many information here. So now, for example, this one is the loading, the load. Uh, current is a five amps. The power, the load, the loading power is a one hundred twenty six, one hundred twenty four, something like that. The total uh, consumption of the uh, uh, loading. So the battery, the battery, uh, the battery information. The solar panel, the PV, that means the, the voltage of the solar panel. Because now we connect only one piece, one piece is solar panel, and uh, the sunshine is not very good, the sun is no good, so the voltage is not very high, 38, 37 is not stable. And the current, solar panel current is not high, it's very slow because now no sunshine. The PV, total PV uh, generated power. The battery voltage, uh, the battery current, uh, charging from the solar panel. So we can, can we can uh, make uh, we can see all kind of information from the LCD of the MBPT, and uh, we can also control the loading from the from the MPPT. So we can see here the load type, load type. We press the confirm for a few seconds, and uh, now you can see we can select the uh, load type. If we select off, you you can hear there is nothing. Uh, loads no nothing uh, from from the loading, and then if we select the on, and then press the on, so you can hear the uh, DC freezer is working again so that means that we can control the loading from the uh, MPPT charge controller so this is the, the uh, presentation of the system thank you very much and then if you have more questions you can contact us at uh, our website uh, and then uh, you can contact us for uh, any further Question. Thank you very much. Bye bye.